I'm at EFA 2018, where I've got my hands on the Huawei Mate 20 Lite. The Mate 20 Lite is a 6.3 inch screen device. Full HD plus resolution, the screen looks nice and punchy. You've also got a glass back, feels very nice and premium, as well as a metal frame. Headphone jack fans will rejoice because Huawei has retained the headphone jack here. And on top of that, you've got Histen technology or Histen, H-I-S-T-E-N. That's Huawei's proprietary audio tech to make the equalizer sound that bit better. You can also expect Android under the hood, Android with Emotion UI 8.2. This isn't the latest version of Android Oreo, but you still get access to all the applications in the Google Play Store. What's more, Emotion UI adds a bunch of functionality such as AI gallery, so it can auto sort your pictures for you, which kind of sounds creepy, but kind of sounds cool too. There's knuckle gestures as well, and a very, very customizable home screen experience, though stock Android fans may find it a little bit much. Around the back, there's a 24 and 2 megapixel camera, and that's the same combination you have at the front, though the rear cameras have a wider f1.8 aperture versus the f2 aperture on the front. Both sets of cameras can make blurry background pictures happen with that second camera capturing depth information. While it also has a ton of shooting modes from full manual right through to light painting, etc. Though the P20 and P20 Pro's amazing stabilization hasn't made its way on here, so nighttime shots is probably where this thing will drop the ball. Powered along by a Kirin 710 processor, you should have ample power to get through a day and multitask and all that good stuff, but it won't be a flagship when it comes to gaming. There's also four gigabytes of RAM, 64 gigabytes of storage, and it's expandable by 256 gigabytes if you stick a micro SD card in there. The 3750 milliamp battery should get you through a full day as well, and there is fast charging loaded up, but not always super fast, super charge. Expected to launch in the UK in the next couple of weeks, costing £379. This looks to be a premium looking device with some flagship features that cuts back in a few areas to save some bucks. Check back for the full review in the coming weeks and hopefully you've enjoyed this hands-on video. For more on the Huawei Mate 20 Lite, visit techradar.com.